-hmm. So Richard Summer came in in, 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 a, in a very non-traditional way, you know, provided support, mentoring, and encouragement in your first, in your first, uh, was that back, what, what, what winery 19, was that? 1987. Uh, and, and you were at, that, at that time, that was, uh, not Hillcrest. Tory Moore, Hillcrest. Hillcrest, yeah. And a, a unique and eccentric individual, and certainly we were talking earlier about some of the amazing stories behind Richard, who has uh, really carved his own path with uh, a right. lot of, uh, you know, wild and crazy times uh, right. and, and being an absolute immense presence in the Oregon wine community yes. for, for decades yeah, For now. decades, yes. Right? Yeah, uh, he, he, yeah. started, he started in the 60s, I believe. Was right. It? it was post-prohibition. He came up here in, I think it was 1962, and, um, and he was seeking a good Riesling ground. He wanted to grow Riesling. That yeah. was his goal. And that's when he came to the Umpqua Valley and he found on the, next to the Callahan Ridge, the uh, Hillcrest site. And then from there, it just it's, history was made. Uh, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> In a lot of different ways it was. Yeah, that's for sure.